I'm Lisa and this is Brunette Wig Place. I am so glad that you are here today. Just a reminder before I get started with this wig review, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below and you will get a notification every time I post a new video to my channel. So today I am wearing this very pretty wig that I've wanted to try for a long time. She's been out for a while. This is Cameron by John Renault in the color 832 Cocoa Bean. So Cameron is just a really pretty bob. She's got a lot of movement. She's a ha fully hand-tied cap, so she's very comfortable. Um, so I've wanted to try her and I was fortunate enough to win her in a little contest, a little giveaway on Instagram from a lady named Heather who has a shop called Pretty Wigs To You. So I will link her Instagram down below this video so that you can uh, access her page. She is a seller, an online seller of John Renault only. So she has had alopecia for almost her whole life since childhood and um, knows a lot about wigs and hair replacement and understands hair loss very, very well. So a uh, really, really sweet lady. Um, in the contest, I also wanna thank her. She sent a little um, John Renault travel kit, but she sends these with every wig. So if you buy a wig from her, she sends these little travel kits for you. It has the Fiber Love Shampoo, Fiber Love Conditioning Spray, HD Smooth Detangler, and the Flexible Spray Gel along with a uh, wide tooth comb. There's a little glare on that. There, I think it's better. Um, so nice little kit and then she also sent a few other little goodies a little hair tie and a little hair clip and some things like that So really really sweet giveaway. I really appreciate um, Heather. Thank you for doing that giveaway So let's get into John Renault Cameron So John Renault Cameron this particular one is the petite cap and I'll show you a little thing that um, Was kind of a surprise to me that uh, Shows you that it is indeed a petite cap. Anyway, in a minute. So uh, let me do a spin and we'll look at her from all the sides and then we'll get into her specs. So here's the front. Very pretty, you know, just goes uh, right above the shoulders on me. I have a four inch neck, so I do have a longer neck. If you have a three inch neck, you, you know, it's gonna be a little bit lower, but um, really pretty length. This is my right side, the back. left side and back to the front. So she is just such a pretty piece. I have wanted to try her for such a long time and this 832 Cocoa Bean has become my favorite John Renault brunette. So I was super excited to get the opportunity to try her. So she, like I said, is a fully hand-tied uh, cap. She comes in average and petite and I think she comes in large as well. So she is one of these ones that they do have different sizes on which is really great, accommodates pretty much everybody that way. So the thing that I wanted to show you was that she is a petite cap and I have another John Renault uh, wig and a petite cap. It's a human hair wig. It's the Kiri that I've already reviewed. And um, I don't have the problem that I have with this one. Uh, so the ear tabs are just a little bit high. So not terrible but there is a little space there. Now I ha haven't found that it's an issue because if I put the hair behind my ears, the hair kind of fills in that spot and it's not a problem at all, but it was just when I first put it on, I was like, wait, whoa, what? <laughs> Why is there a space there? But you know, other than that, ear tabs are really, really nice. They have a, um, you know, I've got great coverage with the cap, um, great piece of metal in there. Um, another thing that I sometimes have this problem with John Renault. The knots on this one are kind of obvious. So um, I have put a little makeup over on this side because I was starting to work on covering them, but I didn't want to cover them completely because I wanted you to see why I'm covering them, which is right in here. You can really see that knotting. So, but it is, you know, full monotop, fully hand tied uh, cap. So you have that appearance of scalp. You can part it anywhere you want to part it. And that's something that I'm just going to continue to work with. I've got this little um, eyeshadow brush and my um, just my powder foundation and I'm just gonna keep trying to go in there and, and hide those knots a little more so you know sometimes you do get a wig that it just needs a little extra maintenance so that's just the way it is but um, but it's not gonna keep me from wearing the wig I still think it's really really cute and I'm really really happy with it so um, as far as her specs she has a 10 inch bang here in the front there is a 7.75 inch uh, measurement on the side 12 inches from the crown and a 4.5 inch nape. Her weight is 3.3 ounces. She's very light, very comfortable. Um, I will pop her off so we can see the inside of the cap here. So full monotop, 
lace front, you know, really nice. You can kind of see where I put that, <laughs> dab that makeup in there, but um, soft, comfortable ear tabs, you know, hand tied all throughout. So that's nice because you have the appearance of scalp, you know, no matter where you move the hair from. Um, she's got a velvety strip back here and she's got the Velcro adjusters, which are really, really nice. Which I haven't even had to move the adjusters, so this cap fits really, really well. Um, and here you can see that lace front a little better. So really, really nice. Okay, throw her back on. She's super easy. She's just kind of a throw and go. And I love the fact that she does have the full mono top because if you are a, you know, excuse me, let me grab my comb here. If you like to part in the middle, if you like to part from the right side, you know, you can part wherever you are comfortable parting from. So A32, this brunette, I've reviewed this color. I had, um, this is the same color that my Allison wig is in. And I just fell in love with this brunette, so that's why I picked it again. It's a tad lighter than the six, um, which I like. So just a little better brunette. To me, a true medium brown. So they describe it as a medium brown and medium natural red blend. But I don't really see a, um, I can't see the red in it. So it's truly blended in there. It may show a little bit outside in the sun. But uh, just really pretty brunette, like I said. It's become my new favorite from John Renault. <laughs> so let's take her outside and we will look at this 832 outside in the sunshine. Okay, so we are outside. I just stepped out of my house. So I am in, I have full coverage of the patio cover here with this 832 Cocoa Bean. Really, really pretty shade. And we will slowly move out here to where there is more sun. It is very bright sunshiny today. So, Ooh, don't want to fall in the pool. Very, very pretty. And you can see that, you know, appearance of scalp there with that mono top. It's kind of breezy. Let's we'll see if the breeze will pick up the hair here. Very pretty. Okay, so we are back inside with this uh, Cameron wig by John Renault in the color 832 Cocoa Bean. So you can see that color is just, it's, it's why it's one of my favorite brunettes. I love it. So very, very pretty out there in the sunshine. Um, now, as far as styling, you know, she's a bob cut with enough length to do a lot of different things. You know, a headband would be cute in her. Um, you can put all the hair back or you could put, you know, Leave some of the hair out if you wanted to uh, fluff her up a little bit behind that. She's got such great light airy movement with the hand tied cap. I just love that. So um, she would be cute like that. You could pull back just your sides, put in a claw clip. And she's got enough length that I think she's gonna stay pretty well, you know, pulled back like that. Really cute. And then she does have enough length. I was playing around with her. She's good for ear tucking as well. Um, she does have enough length for a low pony, but it's gonna be very short. And I think you're gonna have to bobby pin right behind the ears or the, the this hair is gonna start working its way out, you know, as the day goes on. So just something to note. While I have her behind my ears, I will also show you. She works great with glasses. One thing about that little space is I think it gives even more clearance for my glasses. So I can't complain about that, right? And then glasses also go up on top of my head really easily with her too, which I love because I love to be able to just stick the glasses in the hair sometimes to get them, you know, when I need to pull them off because since they are just readers, you know, I'm, they're on off, on off all the time. So, so anyway, so this has been a review for Cameron by John Renault in the color 832. Again, thank you, Heather, from Pretty Wigs to You. Um, I will link below, like I said, her Instagram page so you can find her shop. Just thank you again, Heather, for the giveaway. That was very, very sweet, very kind of you. So until next time, I thank you so much for watching and don't forget, you're absolutely beautiful. Bye.